So when we talk about thermal imaging camera, this is something that is realistically kind of slept on by our industry, especially in the comfort cooling world. Yeah, yeah. There are a lot of non-invasive testing procedures that you can actually view using this. Prime example, look for a restriction in a refrigeration circuit. You'll see a temperature difference. Look for a clog. And this is important. And the big thing is, is that these tools, maybe right now you're new to the industry and you can't afford it. I've been there. But as you start to make more money, you get more invested in your work, you got to get a tool like this. It saves you a ton of time. You can tell if you got blow by in a compressor. You can tell if you got st stuck filter dryers. Yep. Like, and these are the tools that you don't always think about. I never, I never had one when I was in the field because I didn't know. And in some cases, you can actually see loose electrical connections oh, 100%. as well. You definitely can. Yeah. Because like Trevor said, it was something that comfort, cooling techs, even refrigeration techs, we never thought that this could be useful to us. Yeah. But... This can save you a lot of time, make you more efficient at troubleshooting, and help you to get an idea, an actual visual, instead of just looking at pressures and temperatures alone. You can see the issue on the camera. Now, that's for some circumstances, not all. But the biggest thing is, like Trevor said, is investing in yourself. And I'm not just talking about your tools either, your education, your trade. Take pride in it. Yeah, yeah. Use the resources available.